All right, welcome back, guys. We are getting into month number three for Jen's Gamer Education. So, month number three, who, 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 who did we pick? We picked <laughs> Chris, better known as Denver Gamer. Denver Gamer. Yep. I've been uh, subscribed to Denver Gamer now for probably a little over a year. Yeah. Yeah, me, uh, he's a big beat em up guy, so am I, I mm -hmm. love that genre, and uh, he, uh, basically, I, he's the one that helped me mod my Wii. Yeah. If you, need a, if you want to try modding your Wii, go see Denver Gamer, we will put a link in the description. We will, for And sure. uh, he's got a lot more videos than just those, but go def definitely go check him out there. Yeah, yep. really nice guy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So. We have we, a video from him. We do have a video from him. What we should say here is that I know in our last video when we talked about our month one that we were talking about going on to month two and we talked about month one. We're actually filming this a little bit in advance, so I haven't actually yeah, we played. Are almost. We are about five weeks ahead of schedule here with yeah. this video. Yeah. But we're just trying to get some stuff done while we have some time. So have some time. So I will talk more about month two in other videos for sure yeah. but for today we're just doing this one um, Denver Gamer was nice enough to send us a video yeah and I am really excited about all his picks um, I didn't at first he was like do you want me to tell you what games I was like no don't tell me what games but I couldn't <laughs> help myself from watching the video as soon as he sent it so well, let's play that video now. yeah let's play it play. Is this play I think so. I'm halfway it's blind fun. What's up, Retro Rivals? Denver Gamer here. And Jen asked me to give her three games to choose from for her next month of video game education. For this, I went with PS4 games. I'm gonna have to say, Detroit Become Human. This is an incredible um, game. It's like watching a movie. It is just... Uh, absolutely insane. Uh, the graphics are great. A lot of choices, a lot of different endings, stuff like that. Really good one to check out. Um, number two, Little Nightmares. Little Nightmares is uh, an incredible platformer. Really cool, dark, spooky. Um, these, I'm not going to give anything away, but these bigger creatures are trying to kill you. And the twist in the end is really good. Third, What Remains of Edith Finch. And this game is basically a visual novel. Can't really die in it. There's some puzzle solving. Um, but basically, this is a story that's tragic, but it was based on a video gamer's tragedies in his own family, and he translated those into a game and based this game on that. And it is... Uh, just a great playthrough. It should only take you about five hours if you're really doing everything, but it's a short game, really good game. I bet you you could probably do all three of these in uh, your month, but Detroit Become Human, Little Nightmares, What Remains of Edith Finch. Those are my picks for you. Thank you, Retro Rivals. Okay. Everybody else knows that freaking awesome collection he has behind him. Oh, jealous! Yeah. Hashtag jealous! <laughs> Big time jealous. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. So. We don't have any of these games. We don't have any of them at all. None! Um, uh, what Remains of Edith Bitch is a limited run game. From 2017. And it is about 150 bucks. So we are going to go gonna digital. Yeah, we'll be getting digital that. Digital copy. That sucker is on sale right now as we speak. Before All we I talk about that, because you guys are assuming I picked mm. what remains of Edith no. Finch. Here's here's the deal. Challenge accepted, Denver Gamer. <laughs> I couldn't it's even... It's on. <laughs> I couldn't even pick one. I was like... It's like he crawled inside yeah. my head and knows me as an individual and is like, Scary place. holy lord. Like it was, I love all those games. I love all those picks. I have looked at Detroit Become Human yes. so many times yes. and I'm like, Scott, please play it. I don't know if I can play it, but I, I'm going to try. I'm going to try to play it. And to be honest, 
I picked it just in the order he picked it too. I was like, definitely yeah. want to play Detroit Become Human. That's your first pick. That's my that's, first pick. That's the one you'll go through first. Yep. Then Little Nightmares. Yep. Second one. Also. Uh, yeah, we're gonna. That one wasn't super expensive though. I think we could get that on eBay for about thirty dollars. Oh, well. So we I'll might we might get the physical copy of I that. I have it in my shopping cart there right now. Oh, you on do. On PS4 for digital. Oh yeah. But. You know what? I I, it's digital. not. It's not super expensive. Digital should be like a four-letter word. I know. It is uh, end of January right now, so um, there's sales on right now. But you guys will be. You won't know any about thing yeah, about these sales. Too late. Too late. All right. But they. That's seventy-five percent yeah. off. Edith Finch yeah. is sixty percent off. Edith Finch is definitely. We're definitely getting yeah. a digital copy of that. Um, I don't. I don't even know if there's any replay value to it, other than just. Being yeah. a collector and having it. I know, because it's a limited run yeah. game. Yeah. Um, but Detroit Become Human, we're, we're coming for you. Yes. We're on we're the gonna hunt. We're going to find it. I've we're already got. I, I should have picked it up at our local pawn shop when I saw it, but at the time it wasn't really on our radar. I was looking for other things, and I like legit saw it last week. I was like, oh, I, I really want to play that one. What did you see it for though? What was the price on it? I can't even remember. And somebody else asked I'm me that too because it. we make our rounds on Saturdays and check out pawn shops. Yeah. And somebody at another pawn shop said to me, I had to, I had to order that for my daughter online, brand new, seventy dollars. It's hard to get a hold of lately. It's a small city. And yeah. Uh, yeah, so he asked me how much it went for and I was like, I can't remember because I just remember thinking, I want to play that eventually, but yeah. it wasn't what we were looking for that day. At the time, yeah. yeah. Uh, you know, we're on a budget. I kick myself, not for... We're on a budget. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a video on that. <laughs> so, you're going to... You're going to try and knock all three of these games out in one month, huh? I am. Uh... Just so happens, my husband works like afternoon to evening shift, so when I get off work, I'm just gonna be gaming. I'm just gonna be gaming away in my basement. Mm -hmm. Trying to get through three games, I just I can't pick one. Yeah. I yeah. wanna play them all. He made them all I sound mean, enticing. Yeah, the myself, I would definitely like to play the Detroit Become Human. Yeah, I know. We had looked at we seen gameplay of it, it looked like Really awesome. Really cool, yeah. yeah. Uh, as far as the other two, I have absolutely no idea anything about them. Yeah, I don't really I don't either. even remember seeing And I like don't it. want to look too much no. up because I've been trying to do that just enough to get a feel <clears> for like, okay, basically to find out how much the game is. That's about yeah. all I've done so far. I really haven't looked anything so, up outside of that. Physical copy on Detroit Become Human. Yes. Digital on the other two. If digital I really on the like, other two? I think if I really like Little Nightmares and it's a really good game, then maybe afterwards we can get it because I think. Okay. I think for the there was like a complete extra something something edition digital nine ninety nine, or yeah. the other one was six ninety nine. So it's whatever. I'll throw ten bucks yeah, at yeah, it, and if I yeah. if I really like it, then it it'll be worth throwing the thirty. But if I'm yeah. like. Yeah, it's good to play once, but I don't know if I'd ever throw it in again. Then, you know, I bought the digital. I had fun with it. Just like, you know, going to the store and getting a bag of chips. I really enjoyed that bag of chips, but I don't need to, like, put it on the shelf. You know, maybe I feel like that a bit. But I think I'll enjoy them all. I really, really do. Yep. I think they're going to be good. Yeah, I think they are going to be good. Yeah. So, uh, thank you very much, Game yes. Gamer. Uh, really excellent video. Yeah. Adds to our video. Yes, it does. Appreciate that. Yeah. And uh, I guess uh, we'll probably, I'm assuming, be doing some kind of final thoughts, thoughts or first thoughts on each of those games. I think we have to. Possibly all together in one show. I think so. I don't know. Yeah. We're play it by ear. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll feel it. We'll whatever feels through it we'll do that i'm thinking of first thoughts will be all in one video yeah maybe i don't know i, I mean i won't even Can't be play them all. yeah you don't want to give first thoughts and be all the way through one game yeah that's true so i'll have to give first thoughts as they come and maybe i can splice it together as one video i don't know unless for some reason you blow through a game in a week yeah not that amazing at gaming all righty guys till next time keep on gaming keep on gaming